this must be correct. So here in the National Planning Commission, we're also talking about another major facet of South African society, of this rich, poor divide, and that people end up living very far apart. Wealthier people over here, that. Now that's changing. One of my friends likes to point out when I'm in Cape Town and we're around Somerset West, that there's one suburb, which is a quite an upmarket, very nice suburb, and she says those poor people have bought homes there because they've seen their property price go straight down the tubes. Because in a big vacant piece of ground directly opposite that suburb, the government has put up a whole lot of RDP houses. So now the people in the more affluent suburb, well, crime, they're looking across to a dust bowl, etc. their property prices are plummeted. What is the opportunity here? Because this is the future of South Africa. Mixed residential developments sure. are going to be mandated in future. Sure all over the place, wherever there's a big development. The days of building just a suburb for rich people or just this are gone. The government is saying quite integrated correctly, to integrate our society, these people have to be side by side. So what if we solve problems from both sides of the road? The people on this side of the road are worried about crime. And so, for example, are the people on the other side. You're far more vulnerable to crime sure. if you live in a township sure. area than you are from a, in a wealthier suburb. So what about if we started up a company that there's a security company that draws its staff from the people on that side of the road. They patrol there and on this side. So now we're creating jobs for people from the community. They also know the skeletons inside the community, which also helps them police and know what's going on because they live in the community where the source of the crime is possibly coming from. Now we're generating some money. We can take some of that money and we can plow it back into beautification projects on the other side, where we can start painting houses, getting gardens going. Mm -hmm. So now we have less crime. We have we have lifted up the living standard of people over here through beautification and through providing jobs. Everybody is winning. Sure. You see the type of possibilities for doing innovative things inside the new South Africa.